Hi guys. <laughs> Welcome back to Robertson's Belly Acres. Welcome. <laughs> the saga continues. <laughs> yes. Part three. Yes. We finally did see the skunks. We thought we had them out, but come to find out it's mama and three babies. Three babies. So we saw babies the other day. Through the door. Look, 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 look. That's how they're getting in. Right there. Um, they are climbing the uh, coop and getting in through the door. Yeah, they're climbing the door and getting into a small gap. Uh, everybody says they're like rats, so if they can flatten out and get in, they're going to, and that's what they're doing. They are climbing up this and getting in through this little gap right here, and that's how they're getting in and out. They're really cute. I mean, they're cute little things. They are things. not cute. But <laughs> they have gotten to where they come out and eat the kitty food. And that's where we've seen them a few times is where they're coming out and eating the kitty food. And um, <laughs> we're trying not to get sprayed most days. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I wound up getting a couple live traps. Mm -hmm. We're going to set them in the coop with the door shut with cat food as bait. Since they're used to eating the cat food, we're hoping that that'll get them in there. So... Yeah, or dog food. Yeah, we'll put something in there. <laughs> We're going to try this. I'm not sure how this is all going to play out, trying to get them moved and dispatched without getting sprayed. So we shall see. All right. <laughs> We're going to set these two traps inside. I'm leaving the, roost, the rooster and that hen in there just so we can see if we can get them caught. I feel like that's keeping it as normal as possible to see if that'll help us get these suckers caught and get them relocated permanently. Smell the, I can smell the goat. Do you think they'll just go dig underneath that hole? Right. Okay, and we set the, the uh, game cam. So we shall see you guys. <laughs> so we have a skunk in the small trap. Okay. So we set the trap and literally off a timestamp, 15 minutes later, we caught him. So there's the rooster. Oh, the hen. We have the rooster goes back and forth also. But see, you can see his little tail down here at the bottom. Of course, where we had the game cam set up. It was a little bit too high. But see right there, he's already inside the, he's already set the trap, or already tripped the trap. So he's stuck inside there. Okay, mind you, there are four skunks in total. So mama and three babies. So the... <laughs> This was one of the babies that we caught. Uh, see the other tail? That's some of the other ones coming out and investigating and trying to eat the dog food that's kind of been scattered around. Uh, see the tail over here? Now comes the hard part of how do I get him picked up? and out of there so I can dispatch because he's right inside the coop door so he's gonna see me coming so we didn't think this through <laughs> I'm thinking I'm gonna use a tarp and hold in front of me so he can't see me step in and lay it over the trap and pick it up that's what I'm thinking that way right now huh Yeah. 
It's looking at the door. He's standing up. Okay, he's he's so hard to see. He's laid back down. Oh, he's turning around. Okay, now he's looking at the chicken. No, he's he's standing up, but I can't see if his tail is up. Okay, he's laying down. I can't tell, babe. He's just looking up. He just looked up. I can't see because you've got it covered. Okay, do you want me to come hold that door? No. As long as you left enough tarp that where if he sprays, he doesn't get your legs. You know? I'm going to let you get out that door and then I'm going to stop recording. He's moving around in there. Okay. You're loose. 